Jennifer White. Yes. It's good to see you again. Can you let everybody know, uh, yeah, like, like how long you've been in the industry, uh, I guess, like, where you're from, like, your, your a mini background for you? Okay, I've been in the industry 11 years, and I'm from L.A. originally. Yeah. yeah. And now we're out here in Miami at Exotica. Yes, we are. Now, uh, my whole YouTube channel is about helping guys out in the bedroom, giving them some advice on uh, how to lay pipe a bit better. Okay. So, can I ask you this question? Complete this sentence for me. I love it when a man does in the bedroom. Mm. Love it when a man knows how to dirty talk in the bedroom. That's always really hot. All right. Mm -hmm. What? That's actually a great response because we haven't. Had, no one's. No one said that yet. Really? What is an example of something that a guy has said to you in the bedroom that has absolutely just made you gush? Sort of like little commands, like get on your knees, put it in your mouth, like little things like that. I so love it. Actively telling you what to do more so, even if a guy was already going to do it, him actually like just giving the verbal command at the same time. Yes. I'm like, take me, please. <laughs> Pay attention, gentlemen. Okay? Uh, do you have a preference for, for penis size? Is there like an ideal dick size for you? I mean, I'm not a size queen, to be honest, but um, I'm an equal opportunist. Equal opportunity cock. <laughs> All right. But I mean, like, above average, like, maybe six, seven inches, it's perfect. Show us with your hands. Show the hands. Okay. That's, you're saying that's six, seven? Hang on. That's, that's okay. That's pretty accurate. All right. Fine. Yeah. Fine. How I'm about... How, so yeah, yeah, it's like, you know, <laughs> oh, we're going to start punching cervix. We don't, we don't want to punch cervix. when you're hitting a lung. I mean... <laughs> Are you hearing that? All right. <laughs> Don't go puncturing her fucking luck. Circumcised or uncircumcised? Do you have a preference? Um, in the front or the back? Oh, good answer. <laughs> in the can, you, can you explain that? Explain why that is for everyone listening. Okay, so if it's in the front, I'm indifferent. But if it's in the back, then uncircumcised feels better. So it's less friction. Uh, yeah. Glides in and out easier. <laughs> uh, look, for all those dudes who are worried that they, they haven't had their junk cut up, take advantage of it. Yeah. Use it in the butt. Don't be like insecure it. about it. Like, seriously. It, no, it, it's like, it's kind of weird to mutilate baby dicks, I'm just saying. I, I agree. I'm, I'm very anti, like, as a guy who is circumcised, I'm very anti circumcision. So it's kind of weird, but, yeah. like, you wouldn't do that to, like, a, a yeah, anyway. Irrelevant. We agree. We, we agree. <laughs> Spit or swallow? You only spit if it's in someone else's mouth. Otherwise, always swallow. It's a good answer. So snowball, snowball. So it's basically swallow or snowball. Yeah, exactly. Right. Right, cool. <laughs> Don't waste it. <laughs> now, clearly, you should invite Jennifer to your next gangbang. Cream pie or facial? I don't thinking, know. You're thinking a lot about this one. I mean, facials are hot as fuck, but I tend to lean towards cream pies. I like them. Huh. I feel accomplished after. You feel accomplished? <laughs> it's okay. like I leveled up, you know? Really? <laughs> <laughs> Can you elaborate on that a little bit? <laughs> I don't know. Just take it how you want it. <laughs> Public sex, yes or no? Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. where, where are some of the hottest places you've ever done outside? See. Done it at the beach. Done it on a rooftop. Done it in a car. Oh, overlooking a really nice view, though. That was nice. There we go. Yeah. yeah. Quite, quite the collection there. Eating ass. Yes, please. Yes, please. <laughs> Is that yes, please for like having your ass eaten or eating somebody else? Both. Guys and girls. It's got to be clean, but yeah. Yeah. All for it. Equal opportunity butt eater. Yeah. <laughs> I, knew, I knew there was a reason we got along on set. Look. Uh, how often do you masturbate? And do you masturbate to your own porn? To my... There's... Uh, how do I say this? Do I masturbate to my own porn? No. But do I... I kind of recap, like, different scenarios in my head 
where I've like been an like replay. Yeah, but I was like I was having a lot of fucking fun there. And then yeah, I come in silly. Nice work. Your own inbuilt little highlight reel, I like that. If I'm watching my own porn, it's only to like critique myself on angles and yeah, it's yeah, it's like, not horny stuff. Like a professional athlete would watch yeah, tape. Like, you know. You watch porn <laughs> and you critique that makes sense. You're a professional. You're a goddamn pro. All right. <laughs> what is the creepiest or weirdest fan interaction you've ever had? Um. Oh, I had a guy um, sitting under my seat yesterday, licking and massaging my feet. So was... Like sitting under here. Yeah. Is he still there? <laughs> no. All right. All right. Good. <laughs> that would be kind of weird. Yeah. Like, so he just laid down and he just. Smell the different space with your feet. I just had my feet on his face, and he was loving it. Did he pay you for this? <laughs> yes. Dad, you fucking better have. Yes, he did. God damn. <laughs> She's not missing a trick. <laughs> what advice would you give to if a guy wants to get better in the bedroom? What advice would you give him? Ask questions. Yeah. Ask what she likes. Ask where it feels good. Ask questions. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What if he doesn't like the answer? Suck it up. <laughs> <laughs> Jennifer, tell everybody where they can find you, your socials, your, your websites, everything. Okay, um, I'm on OnlyFans at OnlyFans.com slash Jennifer White. I am on Twitter at Jen White Triple X, Instagram, Jen White 2.0. And follow me because I just lost both my social medias and need to jack my fan count up again. So right. let's go build them back up again, guys, alright? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much, sweetheart.